so matter how are you doing how do you feel after graduating um in the state university mm -hmm. i'm doing okay thank you for asking honestly i'm so happy because um it's not an easy journey so i am very happy that i i, I was able to get to this far it's tough it's tough um so you said it's, it's not been an easy journey it's Tell us a bit about the journey. How's it going? You know, every journey always is start with a step, one step at a time. So me being here as an um, as a young adult trying to pursue uh, my degree um, all this and different background, uh, different environment. You know, from Ghana to different world, it's. It's not easy because you need to adjust to everything. Even the studying, the practice and competition, food, language barrier, everything else is a lot. It comes with a lot. You have to mm. go through all this process. So it, it's been a long journey. It is a long journey. Yeah, wow. Uh, you should, just tell me how it feels because your life changed all of a sudden after you won gold uh, in China. And here you are in the U.S., I mean, when you sit down in your quiet corner, <laughs> how, do you, how do you see it all? How are you managing that? Whole? I see like a blessing. It, it was a blessing because God always, God use everything that happened to us in this life, like for a reason. And he make everything that we pass through, whether it's the challenge, everything, it, it tells us something because, um, after the Olympic gold medal, it's, it was a lot that went on, but I, I thought about it like as a preparation. God was preparing me for something great. So that's what I, I thought about. And I see like a challenge. And that challenge has really helped me to work so hard. Trust me, it has really helped me work so hard. I may not understand it after uh, first, but now I do understand it. Like those all those things, it has really helped me uh, become who I am right now. So it's, when I say it's been a long journey, I know everybody that watching me or listening to me will understand how it feels like to go all the way, like 5,000 miles away from your country to, to, to get something done or to pursue education or just even a work, just to go to work. It's, 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 it's not an easy journey because you have to go by everything that is around you. You have to put negative aside and you have to focus on the negative on the positive side so it, it's all about challenge and you have to balance both because some positive side may help you and most of the time people think only the negative thought can help you it can but sometimes the negative things about you have to encourage you to work harder that's what that's what happened to me so all those bad things all those challenges all those negative thoughts all those everything that i went through right now has really encouraged me to be the person I am today. Without that, I don't think I'll get to this far. Well, that's, that's brilliant. And it's good to, to know that you're doing so well. So now let's talk about your athlete life in the US. I know you've won a couple of awards. We have been following that very closely. How, how would you reach yourself? I will never read myself as an average. I think even God will not be God will not be happy for that. I would say excellent because it is it is it is not easy for you to come here to adjust to everything. It might not seem good to be hard it is to get to every every thing to get to. it wasn't a, it wasn't an easy achievement. My coach always tell me that you always have to take an action to actualize your vision because a vision without an action will becomes a nightmare so i always make sure i go with that word it's 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 it's, it's a is a big word that he said and he said that to the same that i never give up i'm always somebody who keep working towards something that i want to achieve whether it is whether it is hard i see it like even if it is hard you have to keep pushing so I keep pushing myself, I keep encouraging myself, I keep thinking, neg I, I keep putting negative things aside of me and then focus on the negative part. And every, every scene I, I need to improve, I have to improve everything that I'm doing and keep moving. 
sometimes it seems it to be far but when you keep working towards it get closer so i'm, I'm blessed with my athletics career right now i'm blessed with people around me. blessed with everything i've gone through and everything that has happened and what is about to happen so i will never agree with myself with myself like an average athlete i would and i, I can't even say excellent let me say excellent because it has not been easy to to be three times all american and i think like um eight times all meag champions and four times a standing performer both indoor and outdoor and then cross country so it's, it's a great achievement